I'm looking for this year's Drake London. So rookie wide receiver, um, ha- he can have a decent year. I'm not. Lo- this guy's not going to be realistically a league winner, and neither is Tank Bigsby unless there's an injury. But um, this guy's not going to be a league winner. He's going to have decent production, um, and then we will most likely see his ADP. If, if all goes well, if all you know, if I'm if I'm talking like I'm right here, his ADP will be halved next year, much like Drake London's was. So, you know, a later round, call it what do we six, eighth, ninth, something like that, wide receiver this year who's going to go in maybe the fourth or fifth round next year, something like that, could end up being the team's uh, wide receiver one after this season. Again, much like uh, Drake London, even though Drake London was pretty much their wide receiver one from day one. Um, but either way, the guy that I'm thinking of is Quinton Johnston. And, you know, I badmouthed Quinton Johnston on this show. I'm not a huge fan, or sorry, I am a huge fan, but I'm not a big drafter of him this year. Again, because I don't think he's going to have a huge season this year. But I think moving forward, and next year, that's why I think his ADP can be halved and he could be looked at as the wide receiver one on this team after this season. So this team is going to have to pay Justin Herbert sooner than later. They can save, I think it's $20 million exactly for Mike Williams after the season's over and just over $23 million on uh, Keenan Allen after the season's over. So again, I don't see it being too crazy, but with this offense, with the Chargers offense, it's entirely possible that they could have 3,000 yard wide receivers. Do I think Mike Williams gets hurt at some point? Probably. Do I think Keenan Allen does? Maybe. But either way, you know, I think Quentin Johnston is a direct replacement for, for Mike Williams in this offense, and he's going to have standalone value anyways. So, you know, 117 targets, 72 catches, 866 yards, and four touchdowns. That's what Drake London did last season. And I think that it's entirely possible even with a fully healthy Mike Williams, even with a fully healthy, healthy Keenan Allen, fully healthy Everett, fully healthy Austin Eckler. Yes, I do think that in this offense that Quentin Johnston can hit those numbers this season, kind of regardless. So like I said, he's not going to be a league winner, but he's a guy to kind of keep your eye on. And, uh, you know, if there is an injury, especially to Mike Williams, then I think kind of the sky's the limit and he can be that guy. He's almost a carbon copy of Drake London as well. Size, speed, everything. Maybe not as much of kind of a mean streak. Drake London has a little bit of a mean streak to him. But other than that, they're almost carbon copies. So I think that this is going to be, you know, Quinn Johnston, this year's Drake London, and we'll see how it shakes out.